Hallo zusammen, I'm your Vlog Dave. I guess we all know some of those, like, hilarious town names. And we are asking ourselves, where did they come from, like, and why? Germany has quite a lot of them to offer as well, so here are a few of them. Number one, Amerika. Yeah, in case you didn't know, Amerika is actually part of Germany. Yeah, it's true. As all of you know, it's located in Saxony and it has a population of 76 people. As of 2011, that is. Number two, Busenhausen. Yeah, Busenhausen translates to something like Breastville or Boobiesville. And the latter part of that word is a very frequently used word for many German towns and villages. And the first part of this town's name is Der Busen, singular Die Busen plural. Number three, Eiterbach. Yummy, this sounds really tasty, doesn't it? Eiterbach, hmm. Mm -mm. Well, all I know is that I don't want to live in Pus Creek. Linguistically, Eiterbach is another compound word, and the first part of it is der Eiter, the Pus, and the second part is der Bach, the stream or the creek. However, congrats on that name, founders of the city. And it's getting even better than that. Number four, Fickmühlen. <laughs> now, foreign people that might be somewhat familiar with the German language might actually think, oh well, this is a really a proper insult. No. And once again, it's another compound word. The first part is Fick, which can refer to the activity Ficken to fuck. Or it can refer to the noun Der Fick which is a vulgar term for intercourse. Yeah, and the second part of that town name is Mühlen. Die Mühlen, plural for Die Mühle, the mill. Pretty lame. I'm not sure if it's cool to say like, oh, I'm from Fickmühlen in Lower Saxony. Might be cool to say that at some point, but... Number five, Blech. Uh, um, uh, Kotzen. Yeah, it's getting even tastier than that. I don't know, but Kotzen might be a really beautiful town with a beautiful scenery, but its name, well, it actually invites you to vomit. Because Kotzen can either be a verb to puke or it can refer to the German noun die Kotze. So I guess some mayor had a really big hangover the day before he had to come up with a possible name for the town. And last but not least, number six, Möse. Yeah, it does sound short and innocent, but it really isn't. To cut it short, die Möse is a slang word for vagina, die vagina, the vagina. I mean, a sentence like, ich komme aus Möse, is really innocent. Yes, it is. It truly is. As long as you don't add the respective dative article der in front of Möse. Because then it's like, ich komme aus der Möse. Where are you from? I'm from Kant. I mean, to some extent, you know, I'm... Yeah, no. I truly think I should just leave it as that right now. However, in case you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and spread the word. Yeah, share this video on social media and on the interwebs in general. That would be greatly appreciated, obviously. And also make sure to check out the video description with many interesting social media links and support options for the channel. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm your Vlog Dave. Tschüss und bis zum nächsten Mal.